Herman, a bit of elite league experience last year, played with the Cardiff Devils, but made his mark really in Telford, uh, yeah. where he uh, put up quite a few points over the course of the season. Yeah, coached by uh, former Blaze coach Chuck Weber at uh, RPI in the NCAA, had really good things to say about his, uh, his ability, his, uh, uh, his personality, said he should do really well in the elite league. Therefore, you know, in the uh, NIHL, you think he'll be uh, one of the top players in that level, and we see why he scores. MK on the board first, and it is Rory Herman. A wonderful individual effort with speed, using those hands to play keep away as he takes that pocket at center ice. Gets around David Clemens, that's a wonderful finish. Block aside on Cozen, and it is the visitors on the board first, here, Stu. Uses his body well to get that, create that angle, shields the puck well, and then he just manages to get himself stretched out so he can get it on the forehand, and that angle there goes far side past Taron Cozen to make it 1-0 to the Milton Kings Lightning. Yep. Great job from... Uh, yeah, the guys in the uh, in the neutral zone there for MK to win that puck and uh, get it up ice quickly. His Hazel turns to the back door, they reply! Alessio Luciani! Catching MK, sleeping on the restart, and a, a really nice direct route from Luciani. As you see him on the left-hand side of your screen here, gets his stick down, takes the feed from Hazeldine. That's a wonderful goal. That's a really nice goal, and a very simple hockey as well. Cook dishes it to Hazeldine, who's coming down from the right side of the defence. Alessio Luciani has just put himself in the right sort of position, and all he needs to do is make sure that he's got his stick down so that Hazeldine can find him, and that's exactly what he does. Yeah. Puck ends up back in the MK defensive zone. Little chip pass up. Doesn't really look like it was intended for anybody. It was almost a bit of a throwaway, but MK have managed to turn this into an offensive chance. Burnside trying to keep the stick away from Herman. And Venus. Jammed in front of Cozen's net. He's got his uh, pad square and low, and they've scored! They managed to poke it in under Taron Cozen. And MK. Look to have scored on the power play. Dudek, tape to tape with Kobe Roth. Roth, all on his own, he will shoot into the pads of Headley. He spills one out in front of him. JD Dudek now, Roth behind the net, does well to collect. Roth out in front, big chance. Headley makes a save, but Kirkup on the rebound scores. Really nice play, to be fair, from uh, both Roth and Kirk up the scorer, and again, you know, Kirk up, you can see the hash marks here, he makes his way to the net front, Roth reads it quickly, and he's able to put that puck where Kirk up can do something with it, he gets two bites of the cherry, and it wasn't quite 10 seconds, Stu, but the Blaze answer relatively quickly again. Yeah, relatively quickly indeed, they're nice little play there, one go attack on it there, and that second one just swipes it past Jordan Headley, really tough to kind of react at that distance, you've kind of just got to hope that it hits you at that point. Well, the first one did, Frank didn't it but you know some great chemistry there and great uh, hockey IQ from both Roth to uh, read the move but also from Kirk up to initiate it and, and you know similar to Luciani's goal just able to keep his stick in a, a, an active position where he can uh, offer himself up as they score again shot from the point from Shearer took a piece of something on the way through I think Stu is let's have another look at this one is there's a little melee at the half wall Cook to the point Share of fires, and I, I, that looked to maybe come off an MK stick uh, just inside the slot there. And the Blaze, two punch, and they're in front. Ruckus. Chipped in by Gulliver. Herman's going to chase that in. And trouble the scorekeeper on two occasions so far in this game. Ruckus to the goal line. Wallace looks at his options, drops it off back behind the goal line. Some pressure comes in from Clemens, puck comes away. Here's Wallace again. One-timer at the point, they score! Solder with a blast on the one-timer, down low, looking for a tip, and it bores a hole through the legs of Taron Cozen. And MK Lightning back on the board on level terms, and Stu, it's been a firefight here in this first period. Certainly has been, certainly a little bit of pre-season, and ben, uh, ben Solder quietly having a game here. Uh, Tim Wallace gets that puck, takes that shot, and then it looks like it's get, uh, got a deflection off Tyler Kirk up before it's gone past Taron Cozen. So yet another one where the netminder is kind of unsighted and has to react quickly. Stewart, going to keep it away from a physical McNulty. 
pulled away by Dudek. Tolberg, little drop off, chance for JD Dudek, he scores! <laughs> off goes the bottle, and the Coventry boys get four on the evening as we have a look at this one again. Lovely work from Hopkins, drops it off, uh, excuse me, Talberg shot top shelf, beautiful. Uh, excuse me, that was uh, Danny Cristo on the shot, yeah. not, uh, not JD Dudek. Loose puck at centre ice, picked up by McNulty. Little shovel across. Going across the line again is Christo. Drops it up, big wrister from Kukali. Loose puck, Kukali on it again, and that's guided behind the net. Kukali, a force in this one as Coventry trying to jab it in front. Christo on the backhand, he scores! Loose puck just came through to the left wing side where Christo was lurking. His backhand banks in off uh, almost the, the torso up under his armpit of Headley. And the Blaze have got a two goal advantage for the first time tonight. Look at that one. He just sneaks it in, banking it off Jordan Headley's stoop. It almost looks like he's aimed it at Jordan Headley's blocker to get that rebound. Clements. Roth just at the edge of his reach behind him. Able to keep it moving though, Kobe Roth. Got the majority of last season in Florida with the uh, with the Everblades who went on to win the Kelly Cup. Roth had uh, been traded to Kalamazoo at that point and there's going to be a chance out in front of they score again. Kobe Roth right on the doorstep picks up the loose puck and deposits it behind Jordan Headley. Roth has been buzzing around the net for an all night and he picks up his reward here. As so we just watch him pick up the pass, really nice play. You know, in that scenario, he can do one of two things. He can try and shoot himself, or if someone like Naughty's creeping down on the weak side, feed him. Goes himself on the backhand and uh, puts the Blaze three goals up. Blaze will bring this puck out of their own zone, dropped off. Dudek now. Oh, he's got some speed, JD Dudek, taking a wide route, out in front! Oh, it's bundled home off Luciani! Off Headley, off Lucci, and into the back of the net. The Blaze have seven, and you know, a couple of goals in similar circumstances in transition for the Blaze, creating chaos by putting pucks in and around the net. And you can see that's a little unfortunate for Headley. It's rebounded right off his pads, right to Luciani, and he gets his uh, second of the night, Stoop. Danny Christo takes that puck off the boards. Dumps it in behind the net, Kobe Roth. Clements at the point. He's got McNulty in support, goes near side. Back to Clements at the point. One timer for McNulty, scores! A blast, block aside. Accuracy and velocity. And Jordan Headley just couldn't get the blocker across as he was moving to his uh, near side pipe. And this is just a thing of beauty from McNulty. Bang! 